This activity about pinhole photography is just one of 12 activities developed by the Royal Academy of Engineering for their Engineering in the Movie set of resources. The guide has information about the history of photography and then it introduces a challenge that students can take part in. And this is where they need to not only build their own camera but then actually take their own photograph. So to make the camera itself, I just use a shoebox which I painted black inside and out. And then to make the pinhole and make it nice and sharp, this was just cut out very carefully from a can. That was then stuck onto the bottom and then I used a piece of uh, other tape that can act as a lens cover. When it comes to loading the photosensitive paper, you've got to be very careful that you do this in a dark room under a safe light. And that just means under red lighting conditions. I used a head torch that had a red filter, but you can also put a red filter over a normal torch. When I took my picture, I went outside where it was nice and bright. I removed the tape over the pinhole for about 30 seconds and then put it back again. What I then did was I took my camera into the dark room. I took out the photosensitive paper out of the back and then I used three chemicals to develop the image. So I put my photo paper first into the developer for about 10 seconds. I then put it into the stop bath for about another 10 seconds. And finally, I put it into the bath of fixer for about two minutes. So this activity works well for key stage three and the students will be immensely satisfied when they actually take and develop their own image. So much more satisfying than just taking it on the mobile phone. So to download this and the other activities, please go to the STEM resources website.